Hello guys and welcome to my first video. Today I'll be removing exhaust system from my E39 M5. To make things easier for yourself, I would recommend that you soak your header bolts at least a day before starting this job. It's always a good idea to avoid rusted fasteners. So in this case, instead of removing the mounting bracket from the exhaust, remove it from the transmission. If I were to do this again, I would remove those lower bolts, so there will be no messing with the rubber washers. Start by unbolting your exhaust from the headers. There are two bolts and two nuts on each side. These are 12 mm I believe. Then we need to unplug our oxygen sensors. There are two per side, one before and one after your catalytic converter. Connectors for these sensors are hidden in this plastic housing. Remove both nuts, pop out the connectors and pull them apart. Now do the same thing on the other side. Notice that on this side my car also has exhaust temperature sensor, which we will have to remove. These connectors should release quite easy, and if they don't, they're probably full of dirt or broken, like this was. And just to seem organized and to not lose stuff, I like to reattach stuff like this back in its place, as long as it stays out of the way. Before you remove anything else, now would be a good time to support your exhaust. If, like me, you are doing this on your back under a car, a floor jack and a jack stand work real good. Remove the bolts holding exhaust bracket to transmission. These are the rubber washers I was talking about earlier. There are four of them total on this bracket. Next, remove your belly pan hangers, otherwise you will bend them when lowering the exhaust. Remove four bolts holding the cross brace to the car. No need to remove those inner two bolts, just leave the brace hanging on the exhaust. And holding the mufflers on, there are a total of six hangers that you need to remove, three per each side. You can probably do this with the rear bumper on, but I removed it for better visibility. If instead of just a nut, the whole stud comes out, don't worry, you can just screw it back when reassembling. After removing all nuts, if your exhaust didn't budge, Give it a good push to free it from the studs. You are now ready to lower your mufflers. Remove your floor jack and reposition it closer to the front of the pipe. Jack it up a bit to take the weight of your jack stands and remove them. You can now start lowering your whole exhaust. Go slow and watch that everything clears. At this point your rubber washers might start falling off from transmission mount. Make sure you pick them all up, you should have four. If your exhaust is still stuck to headers, give it a good wiggle, pull it down, maybe use a prying tool to set it free. You might want to place something under it to make lifting later easier, and then gently lower your exhaust.
And here you have it, exhaust is down in one piece, using just basic tools. I hope you found this video useful, thank you for watching and see you next time.